Welcome back to Great Day. Are you or an older loved one giving serious thought right now to your future living plans? Wouldn't it be wonderful to live out the rest of your days in the comfort of your own home? Our next guest can help you accomplish that goal. Fred Henry is with Comfort Keepers. First of all, Fred, good morning to you. Tell me a little about Comfort Keepers. What do you do? Sure. Good morning, Matt. And I agree with you that there's no place like home. Comfort Keepers is a private duty in-home health care company, and we provide many different services for people in their home, wherever home is. And home can be their residence. It can be at a uh, facility, nursing home, community. It can be in an assisted living facility. And we provide caregivers that offer all kinds of services. And many of those are referred to activities of daily living. So it, it's from companionship to meal preparation, light housekeeping, taking these individuals to their doctor appointments, to the drugstore, maybe out to lunch, whatever, whatever they really want to do. Let me ask the obligatory question here. Those are all important services, by the way. But how has the virus, the coronavirus, impacted your business? And have you been able to maintain those services for your clients during this crazy time? That's really an excellent question. And of course, it's appropriate since we're still being heavily impacted by that. Uh, we've been very, very fortunate. None of our caregivers have tested positive for the, for the virus and actually none of our clients. We did have uh, some of them that decided to postpone services until this was over because they were concerned about continuing doing the things that they were doing. For example, going to the hairdresser, uh, going to doctor's appointments, et cetera. But generally, we've really been very fortunate. And what kind of services are we talking about for our viewers at home? The first one that we really provide and the most important one is to provide companionship for them. And we do have a program where we do focus on the activities that those people were engaged in uh, when they were able to do them. A good example would be gardening, maybe uh, putting puzzles together, things of that nature. And we do uh, laundry, light laundry, light housekeeping and um, medication reminders and just assist them in, in the things that it's made me more difficult for them to do now. Fred, I'm going to wrap this up the same way you started it because I think it's very appropriate. There really is no place like home. Thank you so much for your time. I hope you and your staff stay safe. And for more information for folks watching at home, check out this website. It is comfortkeepers.com slash offices slash Missouri slash STL or give them a call 